Did you right drug friend. for Chu beat? Um, he beat Gigi though. No, hold on. No way. What the yeah. heck? I thought I saw him lose to Cheeto. No, because he was definitely because he was sandbagging. I thought. No, no, no. I saw Cheeto I playing. I thought someone played Peach and someone played Falcon. It must have been the other way around. Is yeah. that Cheeto play Peach and Melee? So no, Cheeto plays Rob in PM. Right. But apparently he played Falcon and Mario today, which is really weird. Oh, so he I've was the Falcon. Oh, yo! Yeah, that's the flip. Oh my god. Get flipped on. Get flipped, dude. That was nuts. But yeah, um, Drug Free 2, definitely not one to sandbag at PM. Yeah. Uh, well, I mean, okay, I take that back. Unless it's like an ISU tournament, you know? Because, like, I I almost beat him in an ISU tournament when he was playing Pit. He just, like, out can't me, though. <laughs> Fireworks. MB's UI having a really nice control center right now. Drug Free Tree trying to use that platform to get in. Gets wrecked. Stuck. Almost fair there, too. Oh my god. Yeah, so the last time these two played... Oh, uh, rip. This sucks. Yeah, he was trying to uh, kind of outplay the mines there a little bit. Let me actually look at how the rest of bracket is panning out. So I know Formula is in Loser's Quarters, I believe. And then I think the other side is like C-Sharp and somebody else. I'm not sure. Oh. Just needs to get a fair. Oh, it just misses it entirely. How is he? I just. I, I don't get all it. Alright, so, like, I'm not gonna lie. I'm on my phone. Like, I'll look down at my phone and then look back up, and he's stuck again. Every yeah. time. What? What do you mean, what am I doing? I can't hear you. He's telling you to get off your phone, I'm, Connor. I'm, I'm here. I'm I'm doing it. You're Are doing you? the thing. <laughs> Reverse fair? Yeah, that's that's classic Tony, dude. It's classic Tony. Yeah, did he, he just throws fairs out for no reason sometimes, but like uh like he throws odd. out he throws out fairs when like you would expect every other game watch to throw out an air. That was really odd. I saw Tony's hands going like and he didn't go anywhere from Smash DI. At all. What at all. what was he getting hit by? Dare. Dare? No, that's like the classic like, oh shoot. You're getting dared by Snake. Help, 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 yeah. Yeah, SDI yeah. me through Snake. And he didn't. Always oh, switching to puff, okay. Uh yeah. Not sure how I feel about this. I haven't seen Tony's puff in Gee, that's a the while. SDI. Yeah, my introduction to Tony was his puff losing to Kofi's Olimar. <laughs> That's funny. Yeah. Was that at uh, EXP? No, it was here. I was here, okay. Nice. Yeah, I never saw DFC at EXP. Yeah, that's fair. He, that's where, actually where he started. Um, his first tournament was like Exposure 9 or something like that, I think. Yeah. You want us to talk about Rat? I talked to Rat for a bit. Dude, yeah, like, I was so excited to see Rat today. I, I talked to that him was a lot awesome. about, about the differences between the, uh, between the old scene and the new scene, and like new players and versus old players. Because it's like, all right, I'm not gonna lie, we'll be we'll be hanging out and playing, and like I don't know who's like a new face around here, like um, MVZY. Yeah. MVZY super Relatively. on the come back, yeah. come up, or Nave super on the come up. And then, like, Sago shows up after, like, a billion years of not playing and touches PM once and just beats Mike. Just, boom, beats him. Or Scythe shows yeah. up after not playing forever and just wins. And it's like, what? I can't hear you, Jack. Uh, that happened at Praxis. I was making up the Scythe thing. No, Scythe beat him at Praxis, too. My point being, and that's not important. I was using that as... as 
placeholders. That, that's that's that could actually, be anyone. That's kind of reminds me of how like Vro's doing at the Or I was literally yeah. just about to say Vro. Or Vro just shows up and and beats Wild. Yeah. With with his Wario. And it's like they don't play the game and it's like what what did they have back then? I mean, because it's not matchup. It, I mean, it's not just the fact that they like they used to play. It's the fact that they're still playing melee. Like the the fundamentals still transfer. Like it, Sago, My, Sago, yeah. Bro, and Scythe are like the three three players that still are active in melee. Yeah. So like I could understand why they they have I guess a better handle of it. My point being that I was leading. Uh, oh my god, dude. Oh, also, these ow. tech chases from Drug Free Chew. Pretty insane. Um, my, my point that I was leading Rat to is, like, I just think that the old days were, were trained more in the ways of, like, how neutral works. Just, just the atmosphere was more... It was less around, look at this cool tech, or look at this this specific matchup and more like and that's why like, learn how to like learn how to think about the game yes yeah i spent nine months just stagnating and like i was doing all right like i was doing all right here but i wasn't doing well because i didn't know what neutral was then metroid showed up and i was playing with him and i just heard him talk about it and he explained it to me oh. and i was like oh this is like smash. He's like, yeah, yeah. And he showed me. He's like, yeah. So when you do this, I I think about this. And Metroid still, uh, I mean, he has an unbelievable neutral. He's probably one of the most like supportive members of the community. Like, even though he doesn't like show up as often anymore, like, he's a really good person to play for. Oh yeah, it's just like one unbelievable go. articulation. Just so so wise, but. Um, oh my gosh, Tony going Falco, what are you doing, my guy? He's trying to find an right. answer to Snake. Just give him a minute. <laughs> yeah. I mean, to be fair, like, this Falco looks like he's doing a little bit better. Because he he's getting combo. I would say this isn't like how he was at Shuffle when he switched to Fox against Solpec. Cause like I was actually very upset when he switched to Fox. It's like, like I feel like it's a, a lot freer of a matchup than uh, his game and watch was. You think so? Yeah. Uh, Puffs versus Fox. Um. I don't know. But yeah, so I. I just talked to Red about that, because that's like something that I believe. I don't know, like, uh, I'll use the Lucario thing today as an example. It was like the, the pinnacle of new style Lucario based on like really advanced techniques, really elaborate, oh my God, don't. really elaborate um, use of like sp project of specific stuff versus IPK who hasn't played in forever. And if your neutral's that good, you it doesn't matter, you know? Yeah. And IPK can do some of the fancy stuff, but like if Kofi and I were to, to money match right now, Kofi would destroy me. Not because um, he can move faster and and SDI harder, but because he just sees the game in so much more of a an interactive way than a I don't know. I'm rambling. It's just something that I believe. So, yeah, Tony's doing all right. Yeah. Doing a lot better than last time. I got a spot dodge on the cart. Although, MVZY is no slide from the comes to the Orleans spaces. Oh. Oh. He slides from the bit. Okay, you know, another example. Um, last one. Drug for Chew versus Tech Boy. Yeah. That's, that is that's the really classic. Good. That's the example. 
Tech Boy just doing like desyncs and all this crazy like ice climber work. And Tony with his Sopo just like winning. Yeah. Down smash. Yeah. Roll back. Wave dash in. Down smash. Just in his head. And it's like that's the, the difference that I was talking about with See, Rad. like if you put those things together, that's like the the package. Oh yeah, yeah. of course. That's you where top both. players come from. Yeah. yeah. That's that's how you become a top player. Yeah. So you like combine the character specific tech, the matchup knowledge with the strong yeah. fundamental neutral knowledge, stuff like that. Yeah. Three, two, one, go. Alright, so oh my god, he's just spamming lasers. Jesus fucking Christ. Okay. <laughs> Mike finally adapts by just crawling at him. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm I'm sorry. Okay. What? Jesus Christ! How does Kelly's Falco do against uh, Mike? Uh, usually wins. Usually wins. Okay. It's gonna maybe like. Dark Free 2 finally found his one character that he feels comfortable against Snake with. Or at least right now, because I, I feel like I feel like Mike could adapt to this a little bit better. Gone. Oh my god, this is laser pressure. Yeah, I know. Okay. I don't All know. Right, I don't know up. how I I'm good. I'm good. I'm back. Okay. I had to I had to say goodbye to the person I was having an elaborate conversation with. I'm I'm here. That's fair. What is that look, Jack? What's that face? That should be an emote. I Jack just pointed. I hate Jack Sudo. Pseudo disappointed. <laughs> Why? Oh yeah, that's um, it. Oh no, he's alive. Great meteor cancel by uh, Tony. No, I think he just waited out the uh, the fall animation. I thought I saw the first thing. Yeah, that, oh, no, that was a oh, great spot. Though. Yeah, he just waited it out. Oh. Oh god, this is the champ. It goes on forever. Forever. Hey, is Junebug at uh, at Big Bell? No. He is coming to Smash and Splash. Smash and Splash? Yeah. I find it really interesting. We have a lot of the uh, sort of like semi retired Project M players coming to Smash and Splash. Uh, Rat Oro is Oro coming? Yeah, Oro's going. Cappy? Uh, I don't think Cappy's going. Okay. Uh, Launchables is going. Launchables uh, is going. He's not playing. He's told us he's not playing like super seriously though. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Junebug's going. Thunder's going. Thunder's is not going. Damn. Unless he decides to like book a flight and talk to us. Yeah, I mean it's just kind of unfortunate. Uh. The a, a little bit, unfortunate, the timing with Big Bell. Yeah, I mean... Well, Don't get me wrong, I, I love that we have this much Project M exposure on both I know. halves of the U.S., but... Um, it's also amazing that, like, there's only, like, 20 cross-entrance between... Oh, yeah, Smash I mean, Smash and Bigger Bell. we're alive, look at this. It's like, we're here. We have, like, 600 people playing Project M within the next, like, two weeks. That's awesome. Oh, nice yellow. Ooh, okay. Tony on his winner's side stop. Dude, I'm so excited for Smash and Splash. I know, dude. I got out of rehearsal, looked down at my phone, and saw the the commentator thing, and I was like, ooh, man. It's oh, time. yeah. Dude, it's time. Whenever you get put into a group chat for commentators, you know, like, oh, okay. We're one of those. It's like one of yeah. those things. It's going to be sick, actually. Well, uh... No, Che and I... Che and I are actually going to prepare. 
Uh, Dude, nice. Like, we are we're serious. I'm probably more serious than Shay, but that's the way that the formula goes. That's fine. Which like. is which is also why I need it to be Shay. It'll be fun. I'm actually... Because, like, last, last time it was us commentating, like, Ellis versus Olimar player number... 3,000, or no, yeah, I take the back. It's not 3, you just did, you didn't get those like super hype pools matches. Yeah, but yeah. with this, we're gonna like, I wanted to actually see who's playing, and if there's some no name, not no name, if there's some random name who I don't know, like, I'll look him up, right? Yeah. And just know, like, brief set history, like, what's the matchup? Like, just really basic, easy stuff that means that Che and I won't go in totally blind, but. No, we'll, uh. We're not gonna stress about it. We'll be. Um, planning it out a little bit. Oh yeah, this weekend, so it'll be good. It'll be really I good. Mean, uh, Che and I are. We'll probably take like a couple sets to get our cadence back. That's fair. Um, because that's like a huge, huge part of commentary. Yeah, because you guys have commentated in a while. Uh, yeah. since winter break, no. We usually lock in pretty fast. I mean, obviously, that's like one of the things. Like when I commentated with uh, Chosen One at um at Escapade. Yeah. Not SP8, I'm sorry. Uh, uh, it was Tussle Town. Tussle, Tussle Town. Town, top eight. It took us like three or four games because it'd be like. Yeah, we'll what? You did, you did, you know what I mean? Oh, like, yeah. Like, like, yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. Go ahead. I, so, I, no, sorry, I, sorry, sorry, sorry. I wasn't sorry, saying bad. anything. No, no, sorry. No, that's the, what. What? I hate you, Connor. That's my point. I hate you, Connor. Is when you commentate with someone <laughs> new, you don't know what their phrase set like structure is like, and so you start yeah. talking when they do, and then you stumble, and you don't know if the other person's assertive enough to like. It's all the commentary meta. I know, dude. Like it's the commentary meta. You I, gotta think about it. See, I only like do commentary meta for competitive Pokemon for VGC. Oh, uh, I feel that. Yeah. yeah, and like, because that's the only, like, that's the only thing I could commentate because it's, like, a lot slower and it's a lot easier to, like, analyze okay, what yeah. plays they're, yeah. everybody's trying to make. So, like, yeah, you, like, with Pokemon commentary, it's, like, it's black and white. It's, like, you have, uh, you have, like, a color commentator and then you have a play Roles are super important. Yeah, roles are super important. I mean, like, I asked, I asked Chosen One, at Tussle Town, I was like, hey, are you a color commentator or a play-by-play? -play? And he laughed, he's like, I don't know, man. And I was like, yeah, it's fine. Let's, See, let's figure it out. That, that's the thing about Smash. I feel like it's a lot more fluid. It's more, f yeah, I was just about to say fluid. Good, yeah. Swan. Yeah, that was good. Yeah. We're in sync. God bless. We're entering the uh, the Jaeger Drift. The Jaeger Drift. From Pacific Rim. I've not watched it. I would not pilot a Jaeger Drift. I'm sorry, Swan. You haven't seen Pacific Rim? No, I've not. Never mind. It's like the pilots, one half controls, one pilot controls the right half, the other pilot controls the left half, and their yeah. brains have to be linked. Oh shit. I would not, no, no offense, no I thanks. would not pilot a game with you. Anyways, no yeah, so Che and I are like, I'm going to text him this week and like, we'll actually discuss what our roles are. It's like, I, I've started to think about that type of stuff. The commentary meta is evolving. I yeah, am dude. the pleasing aesthetic backdrop that doesn't say anything too outlandish. I'm just there. People are like, yeah, okay, I'll listen to this person talking about it. It's going to be nuts because we'll have, like, a lot of viewers next week. Yeah. Like, guaranteed. Like, I, I checked the I checked the um, training day for Valk today. Thousand? Yeah. There's 1,100 oh, or something like that already. And it's like, like, pools haven't even started yet. So. Can you just double laser? Uh, he totally it. did from the edge. Yeah, Mike's starting to get his groove on. I don't know, like, the commentary is super, super interesting to me because unlike actually playing Smash, commentary comes naturally to me. Yeah. Which is like, thank Christ. Can you imagine if I had to put in as much work in this damn, <laughs> in this damn part of the game to be a decent commentator? Oh that would God. be awful. Did you see him try to, like, throw that dart out, like, Four times. Yes. Uh, getting stuff. Oh. Oh my God. He Tony, if the you laser. if you do this, you're a legend. Although it's Mike against Spaces, and he's figured out he can just crawl under the. Yeah. Always oh, living. Uh, that was excellent, DI. No way. Oh where God. Are you, where are you going? I also need to make a Twitter this week. Do please do. Like Conrad SSP. 
or something. I just changed my Twitter handle. Oh yeah, I don't want a personal Twitter. Too much social media. Which sucks because I need one for music. Uh oh. I need social media for music, and I specifically last week was like, I'm getting off Facebook. So I rarely go on Facebook now. Oh, oh damn. Cool. Uh, what was that? Three, three, one, two? three two. Yeah, two. three two. Tony brought that.